Hey everybody, welcome back. I mean, I've been sat here editing, you, yeah, getting ready for next week's animes. And I was like, I'm in the mood for some music. I'm in the mood for some music and artists that I've never heard of. So, I click on YouTube, I click on music. I'm going to click on this one right here. Now, this is Zack Knight. And this is the song Bollywood Medley Part 9, or PT9. So that means there's, there's a lot more. <laughs> I mean, and looking at this, this came out days ago, two days ago, and it's already had 345,000 views. That is awesome. So I'm going to click on the about section. I'm going to see if there's anything about the artist, because again, I don't know anything about him, you know. So Zach Knight, born in Grimsby, North England, um, to a Punjabi mother and an Afro-Asian father, British singer, producer, and economics graduate man this guy first started out in music writing for household names impressive i like to know who those names are if you know drop in the comments below his early influences were usher boys to men and michael jackson if that's his influences i'm looking forward to this now this video what i did notice unfortunately is it doesn't have subtitles so if it's not in english i'm not gonna be able to understand the lyrics but we'll get a feel we'll get a feel of the song and drop in the comments below if you are a fan let me know if we should check out more from zach knight if we should go back and what songs those should be and if you're like me and this is your first time hearing them i would love to know what you think as well so let's jump across and find out and remember if you enjoy this content make sure you hit that subscribe button let's Cool. Oh. That smooth vocal, that vibrato. That is beautiful. I mean, this guy is smooth like his vocals. Can't just shout out, I love this style of vocal. This is beautiful. Incredible. I'd love to know what these lyrics are, but I'm feeling such a real big, big emotional vibe. Oh, that low note, bro. <laughs> this is vocal acrobatics to a new level right there. Oh, he's painful image, you know, like him in the house alone, that car image. This is a sad song. Is it about a loss? Oh man, this is... Oh. Damn, this guy's good. That vocal control, his breath work, his vibrato, the acrobatics as I like to call them, the various notes between the scales that he's hitting are fantastic. Is that finished? Oh, I honestly thought we were going to get more. That was such a short song. Two minutes, 30 seconds. Vocals. Masterclass. Image. Smooth. The storyline, I'm guessing, is a sad one. Maybe about loss or losing someone. Because that's the imagery I was pulling from it. The wonderful vocal tonality that he was riding through those scales on. And that for Brad, oh man. 
And the way he was just reaching between the scales, and like I called, the vocal acrobatics were just absolutely on point. This guy, let me know in the comments that we should check out more from him. Let me know if you would love that song. If you're already a fan, have you seen this guy perform live? Let me know. That was awesome. Ah, oh, bring it on. Oh.